Welcome to Electronic Creations. Today I'm gonna show you how to make soldering fume extractor. So, so, so. Electronic Christian. For this project, I'm gonna need four 18650 batteries, battery holder connected in series, voltage meter, button, PC fan, fan speed regulator, and carbon filter. I'm gonna use this box for placing everything inside and let's proceed the box will look something like this this fan will be inside the box batteries will be on the top for easy replacement all the meter will be some, somewhere here and speed regulator will be on the back inside the box and the button also on the front side we will place this carbon filter Battery will be here. Hole for this fan speed control will be here. And I will put this button on here. There is a mark. Need a trick mark a hole exactly like this for this I will use a journal To explain uh, how things are gonna be wired, the positive will be connected to the, the switch. From switch, it will go on this voltage regulator. This voltage regulator will be connected back to negative. So we have a circuit here. This voltage tester will be connected positive also to switch and this to negative 
so he will only work when switch is on and the fan goes in here now I need to wear that all inside I will mount the fan with this silicone blaster. You can also use uh, hot glue, but hot glue you have very short time to mount it, and that might be a problem. And this you can move it around freely. Make sure you have checked airflow. If you correct correctly connect the wires, airflow will be going up. about 10 minutes and then I will proceed connecting everything else
música. Fume extractor is all finished, and now it's time to test it. On the bottom you don't pull that good but you can see here on the top we have a nice pulling power it sucks everything in I don't smell anything and that's good I also use this outer box to protect this carbon filter because I noticed it's very fragile and this gives extra layer of protection when you're holding it in your drawer or your toolbox you don't need to worry that anything will punch through Thanks for watching and please subscribe.